Hi everybody, welcome or welcome back. If you are new to my channel, I really hope you will choose to subscribe. It's free and it's easy. It's the red button that's right underneath this video. If it, you press it and it turns gray, you're in. It's that simple. There's also a bell that's beside that subscribe button. And if you press that, that's called the notification bell. All that's gonna happen is YouTube will send you one email notifying you that I just uploaded a brand new video. It's a great idea to hit that notification bell because then waiting in your inbox is something fun for you to watch. And also sometimes my videos are um, time sensitive because I have deals and things like that that I don't want you to miss out. So you'll be able to see in your inbox what the uh, the picture of the video and the description of what is in the video. And you'll be able to either press it right away on the picture and it will bring you like a shortcut directly to the video. So it's it's just a really great thing. So that's what that bell is that's beside the subscribe button and I recommend even if you are uh, currently subscribed to my channel, which I appreciate, that bell is a good thing to, uh, to press. All right, today what we're going to be talking about is the Ipsy Plus. This is the middle of the, of the range of what Ipsy has available to us now. We started with the $12 bag, which is uh, deluxe samples. Sometimes they sneak a full-size brush or something like that in there. But on the Plus, it is all full-size. It's usually five, and like I said, it is a $25 box. And then we have the Ultimate, which I've already posted. I haven't gotten my mini one yet, but I did post the Ultimate. So if you want to take a look at that, it was a really good one this, this month. So this one, like I said, is called the Plus. I don't know if I mentioned the Ultimate is a $50 uh, a month box. That one is a mixture of eight full size and four deluxe size. But this, what's exciting about the Ipsy Plus is this really is um, equivalent to what BoxyCharm started with, which is now called their base box. So they're both the exact same price. They usually have five products. I think BoxyCharm sometimes uh, has five or six. I'm not sure, but they're both $25 and they're both full size. Okay, so we're gonna open this guy up and see what we got. You also get to choose one customized item uh, in here, and I did that as well. And this month they had add-ons that you were allowed to purchase as many as you wanted. Usually it's only five per box, um, and all of them I ordered because it was as many as you wanted. That's gonna be uh, when I do my, uh, I did it on the smallest bag, but I'll also do that as a separate because I think I went a little crazy this month on the add-ons because they were really outstanding this year. And I usually do just the $3 ones and things like that, but we'll talk about that when that arrives. Okay, so this one today is, like I said, the Plus. In the Plus, we get a card, and the card this month is called Clean Slate. You get a bag in each one of the bags. They call them, Ipsy calls itself the Glam Bag, Ipsy Glam Bag, but the only one that really comes in a bag now is the first one that they started off. The rest of them, the Plus, which we're showing today, plus the Ultimate, those come in boxes, but they all are called Clean Slate. This one comes with a card with has a little bit of a description and also the retail price of what the uh, products are. It always comes in this cute box. It says discover yourself with a piece of foam. So I'm just gonna empty everything out of the box so everything is lined out in front of me and then uh, that'll give us a little bit more room. All right, perfect, okay. So I'm gonna go buy the card so that I don't leave anything out and then we will start. So the bag this month, all of them have this type of material in it. And what I thought they've done, which is really, really great, is each one has a different size. So the smallest bag has a smaller, this one's a little bit bigger, and then the Ultimate has a really fantastic bag. But what I found that they're doing, which is really nice, is even on the lesser expensive bags, they're using the exact same material. So it's really just the size and the design of the bag that's different, but the quality on the $12 is using the same materials or the quality on this one as well as the larger one. So I really like that. All right, this here is a wrist handle, which is new. And inside here, they have their name and a lining inside. The outside material is a really, really, um, almost feels like a rubbery type of feel, which would be really easy to clean off if it gets dirty. The back is completely this. 
and the front has half this and half this. So really, really cute. So nice bag. So like I said, Ipsy is the only one so far that I know includes a bag with each one of their boxes. So, okay. So this one here, what we're starting off with the first item in the card is called the Pearlice Blue Lotus 4-in-1 Adore Serum. It looks like this. Now eye creams always look a lot smaller because you really don't need a lot and I just want to share with you guys a couple of tricks that I do with my eye creams. So this one is called Prevent Blue Lotus 4-in-1, the Eye Adore Serum. They're saying it hydrates, intensifies, firms, and brightens, and de decreases puffiness and it's good for all skin types and they're saying this is half a fluid ounce. So. What they wrote on the card is, your under eyes are delicate, so this serum is designed to handle them with care. The four-in-one formula contains a plant-based powerhouse like a French marine plant, soy proteins, and vitamin E to target the fine lines, crows, feet, dark circles, and puffiness. So they're saying the tip, oh, that's an interesting tip. It says the tip, the concealer creasing under they're telling you to apply this serum underneath to lend an extra life to your coverage and minimize fine lines, giving your eyes a brighter, tighter appearance. So that's really cool. Okay, so this is what it looks like. There's no seal, it's just a small little point. The trick with eye cream is they say to use your ring finger, they're saying that's your, um, your weakest finger. And then you put a little bit, like a pin size amount on it. Then you take your two ring fingers together and you tap it a couple of times and it distributes the product on both sides. And that's enough for you to go uh, around here and here. So it's your orbital bone. So you don't go too close because it will migrate. So you want to make sure to do it as low and then let it do what it's got to do. Don't forget your crow feet area and that's the the tap 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 movement that we do the item is such um it's not a cream it is absolutely a serum and it totally totally phew, my skin just drank it in so this i think will be one of the first eye products for me that i will be able to actually put on and then immediately put my makeup on over eye cream for me i find it should be a thinner um, cream or a serum if you're planning on putting makeup over it. At nighttime, it's completely different. It's fine if you put something a little bit heavier, but always be careful in that eye area, but really excited to use this. And I'm very impressed with the Per Release line. And this they're saying is a value of $58. Okay. The next item here is from a company called Nature's cartel they're saying it is a lipstick in the 90s so let's see what this is here this is the cute box that it came in with my favorite print look at that okay and that's what it says here so the name of this is just says 90s nostalgia and knowing me i did that upside down so hopefully it's okay here and that's the whole box and inside the box we have a lipstick and the name is here where it says the name of the company. And then on the bottom here, you will see the 90s nostalgia there. Okay, and let's open her up. Okay, and that's the color that's there. So I'm just gonna put a little bit here. Very creamy. It looks far darker in the tube than it shows up on the hand. So I did a couple of swipes to get the color to be stronger for the camera, but I'm gonna do just one swipe. I just did two, back and forth. So that's what it is here, and that's a couple more. Really pretty. Okay, let's see what they wrote about this company, because this is a new company for me. This says it is a 90s inspired beauty look, and they're saying they're having a moment right now, and this brown mauve lipstick from this company is exactly what you need to get it on the trend. It is a creamy, non-drawing formula that feels comfy on the lips, plus it's vegan, cruelty-free, 
and that's that. So then they're saying the tip is to prep your lips with an exfoliant like a scrub or a damp washcloth and a hydrating balm before you swipe on this shade, which will give you a better color payoff. And they're saying this is a $15 value, but it did go on very creamy. And I really like the color. I think that's really pretty. Okay, that's the second item. The third item that we have is from Sugar Cosmetics. And that's what it looks like here. And on the second of every month is the Ipsy month where you get to see what's in your bag and then do your add-on. So of course I check all three of my bags so that I'm not adding on products that were already gonna be in my box. That's how I do it. And I try to film it so that everyone can see what's available and what is gonna be in my boxes. A couple of people wrote me back and I'm really excited to try this product. They, um, it was one that I didn't know and I mentioned that and they received this in the past and they said it's a fantastic liner. So I'm really, really excited to try this out. So once again, this is another brand, but a couple of other girls um, that either follow me or um, follow me here on YouTube or on Instagram were the ones that wrote to me and said that they are enjoying this. And this is saying it's called Wingman and it is a waterproof micro liner and it's called I'll Be Back. That's what that is here. And what it says, it says it's the, the best cat eye, you're gonna get the best cat eye of your life with this jet black liquid liner. It's firm, easy to control. It draws clean, crisp lines every single time. No pro skills required. And the best part, the formula is 100% waterproof. So once it's on, it's on. And they're saying the tip is to shake the pen before use. Store it upside down to prevent the felt tip from drying out between uses. And your future will thank you. And this is only $11.99, which is a phenomenal price. So if this is good, which the girl said that it is, I am really, really excited about it. So let's see one thing here. Yeah, it's saying it was made in Italy. So really, really excited to try that. Brand new product for me. The next item here is called Duft or Doft. It is a pink milk mask. They're giving us a set of six. It says if you're staying in, these easy to use sheet masks are infused with skin brightening combo of uh, niacinamide and ginseng. It says it's taking skin from dull to dewy in less than 20 minutes. It's perfect for that post-holiday self-care Sunday they're saying the tip is the thin skinned neck area needs just as much care as your face. So before tossing the pack, squeeze out the remaining essence and press it into your neck and chest. And they're saying it's $14.98 for a set of six. That is fantastic. So they gave us two of these and I'm assuming there's got to be three in each one because it's a set of six. And I recommend that also if you've watched my channel a little bit, you know that what I say is they always put a lot more serum in this. So when you take this out, be very careful when you pull it out, pull it up from the top. And there should be a lot of the serum left over in here. Roll it up, put a clip on it, and then you'll be able to use the serum in here for at least a couple of days. Normally, that's what I have found with my least expensive sheet mask and my more expensive ones. Same, same thing. I do it and then I get to enjoy that serum for a couple more days. So make sure that's a, a really good tip that I have been enjoying and I wanna make sure to share that with you guys. And then the last item was my pick and it was a Huda Beauty Obsession Palette in Ruby. The uh, value of these palettes are $27 and it says the, the color that I chose, it's called Ruby Obsessions and that's what it looks like here. And let me just reach you and then we'll open it and do some swatching. So it says, achieve your Instagram worthy Huda level makeup. Even if you don't have her skills with this versatile shadow palette, the collection of four matte and five chrome shades will blend like a dream. And the trendy scarlet and berry hues are shockingly wearable and super flattering. They're saying the tip is to score a smoky eye by blending a darker shade in your crease, lighter hue along your brow, and your inner corners and one of the chrome shades right in the center of your eyelid. So I have been enjoying these smaller palettes. I think I have four or five of them now and uh, they are definitely go-tos for me. What's really great about them also is not only are there nine shades in here, this top part is a window. They also come with this plastic sleeve which I recommend to keep so that when you travel this doesn't open up and flop around and it keeps it pretty compact. 
So really enjoy that. So let's see if um, I can pull this back. Yeah, I can. Okay, so like I said, there's a, a mirror behind here and that's what the colors look like. Really, really pretty. All right, let's do some swatching and then we should be done. Okay, so we got some mattes, some shimmers. So there's no names on these and there's no names on the back. And I feel the names are cute to have on palettes, but only if you're trying to explain when you're doing an eye tutorial. So those are the first three. Yeah, her, her formula is phenomenal. Her more expensive palettes and these little guys, I find are fantastic. I, I've been reaching for them, enjoying them. I travel with them. I think they're really great. In between the swatches, I just use uh, a cleansing wipe to take it off and then I have a towel here just to dry it off. Okay, the next three are the middle three. Let's do those guys, that's what they look like here. The very one seemed to look a little powdery, but on camera it's looking better. So that's perfect. And as you know, with you know finger swatches, it's really just to get an idea of the color. But when you use a brush for your eyeshadow, uh, it's not as um, to get these colors. Usually, you have to build up, and I think that's great because you don't want to have a color that's too too strong, and then you spend half your morning just trying to blend it out. So, but these colors I think are just stunning. Wow. Really, really pretty. I'm just gonna wipe my fingers off and then I'll put it up side by side so we can see what the palette looks like versus my, uh, my hand swatch. And there you go. All right, hope that looks good for you guys. Get it all on camera. Perfect. All right, and this one is called Ruby. So like I said, these palettes I think are such a treat. And if you get an opportunity, a lot of times they have them on for, for the $12 or so on and so forth, but even $27 I think is an absolute steal for this. So if you can get them in a box or get them as an add-on, definitely anytime you see a Huda Beauty, uh, I, I would grab it. They really, really impressed me. And that's my box. So this is the Ipsy Plus that is for January 2020. And I have been really enjoying my boxes this month. A lot of them come uh, usually at the same time, but for some reason this month it's coming out. Not every single day am I getting a box, so I'm really getting to play a little bit in between, and I've been really enjoying that. So hopefully you will check my channel and see the other boxes that we've already received, because so far I truly believe that all of them have been winners, and I hope you guys feel the same way. So I hope you will leave comments down below. I love the communication, and don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you're too shy to leave me a comment, the thumbs up at least allows me to know that you guys were here and YouTube says the thumbs up are important. So I wanna make sure to remember <laughs> to tell you guys to do that. Also in the comments down below, I'd love to know if you're still getting the Ipsy Plus or if you're still receiving any of the Ipsys, I would enjoy to know that as well. So once again, thank you for finding me. Thank you for joining me and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye for now.